be on stage because I love to perform and when I perform I feel I have so many things to say to the audience. I have this huge responsibility to play composer's work to the very best and to express my feelings and all the emotions I have to the public. The highlight of my piano career was, I think, um, the Liszt competition I did three years ago, the same competition, um, because um, I've learned so many things and has left a very um, strong position in my heart. If I could ask Liszt a question, if, is it just one question? <laughs> Since it's one question, it has to be something very punchy, I would ask him, when was the toughest period of your life and why? And I would like to see what sort of music he wrote during that time and if that's been reflected in his music. My mother always told me to always keep smiling and especially on stage. In fact, we practiced smiling when we were young. Not many people know about me that I can't ride a bike. <laughs> I can swim though, but I can't ride a bike. And oh yes, I have very bad balance. My guilty pleasure is I love to drink whiskey and Japanese sake, also nibbling on cookies. I have to always hide them, otherwise I finish the whole packet. If I wasn't a musician, something very different, like a chef, but a master chef, where I own like many restaurants, and I hopefully be cooking a lot. Otherwise, a dancer? But I have bad balance, so I've prone on the work. So a chef, master chef. In my future, I would definitely love to be performing all over the world. I would like to have a dog. I would like to be settled and have hopefully two grand pianos. So I'll need a big house for that. This to Beethoven. Um, well, it, that is very easy for me to say list, but um, since I'm going to play, well, Beethoven's, you know, piece later on, so I feel if I say Liszt, Beethoven will punish me. So I'm going to say Liszt and Beethoven for now, just so Beethoven won't kill me.